So Jerry Moffat here, uh, Head of Productions for the First Ascent team. We're at 21,000 feet and our production facility has become a little bit more primitive but uh, just as effective. Filming the dispatches can be a relatively challenging business. We plan the evening before the content for that specific dispatch. It's difficult, you got to get up really early in the morning, it's very cold and then we head up the face typically ahead of the climbers. I work with uh, Nawang Lakpa Sherpa and he basically makes sure that my rigging is secure, that we're off the main fixed lines, the camera's safe, the tripod's safe, and then I can kind of focus on the task at hand, which is trying to pull a focused shot with the right exposure. All of the footage that we shoot is onto a solid state card, which is then put into our trusty MacBook Pros and these have been functioning superbly all the way up. We're above 21,000 feet. We back up the footage here. Then we transfer the card to one of the Sherpas. They run it down to base camp and it gets into Tom's hands and then he begins the magic of the edit. We're here at base camp at the moment waiting for a set of cards to come down from up off the mountain for our next dispatch. Good to see you. Nice good. You. Yeah. Yes. Good. Thank you very much, Andy. Much appreciated. Yeah. Thanks Thank you. your whole work. Yeah. Take care. <laughs> bye bye. Thank you. I will get the footage on the express cards, which go straight into the MacBook Pros we use, and we'll back them up onto two separate portable hard drives. These hard drives are proven very reliable at altitude, which is a big plus for us. Once I've backed up all the footage, I then go through, logging it, seeing what shots we have there, seeing what's relevant for the dispatches, and then importing the relevant clips into Final Cut Pro. It's at that point that I start putting together the dispatch. We then go through our music library we have with us to find a piece of music that will go over the dispatch to give it an edge and give it a higher production value. We then encode it ready for the internet. The encoded files are sent via our BGAN, which is our satellite internet connection, to the Eddie Bauer FTP site in the US. Once they've received the files, they then post it online on their website. So as you can see, it's quite a thorough process getting the footage from off the mountain down to us here at base camp and edited and online. We pride ourselves on the quality of the footage that we're taking and also the amount of detail we put into the dispatches. They are actually thought out, thoroughly planned and looking amazing considering we're at base camp at 17,500 feet.